Hey guys, what's up? It's Devin here with DW Golf Co. And uh, we're back for some more uh, exciting golf course design action here on Mammoth, Go Mammoth Pass Golf Course. If I can talk, man, struggling with the words today. Cool, so uh, we just finished up our 18th hole, this finisher coming right up here to the clubhouse. Um, so now it's time for details. Details, detail, detail. Um, I've said it on a few different episodes when we've done a full um, course playthrough that man, this fairway is extremely wide. And I've had a couple thoughts about what I want to do with it. And um, one, of, one of the thoughts is bring the stream in closer. Um, that was one. And then one that just kind of hit me here in the last day or so is you could do a split fairway with more of the rocks in the middle. And I kind of like that idea. Um, just looking here out at the, out off the tee, I could see running a ridge of rocks just kind of straight through here. Maybe even a little bit more toward the inside so it narrows this up quite a bit. Um, that way it kind of presents a, a risk or reward type of a scenario there. Um, so that could be a possibility here. And so I'm going to go ahead and add that in and then it will be detail Mageddon until my head explodes. So that's going to be a lot of planting, a lot of um, adding rocks, all that kind of fun stuff. Um, touching up some rough areas or making areas that I think look rough um, look a little better. Now that we've gone through 18 holes, now we can kind of see, okay, what are the, what are the things that could could be improved um, probably building up a little bit more of this backdrop so it it's cohesive and makes sense stuff like that more detail stuff like that we'll make sure the river terminates in a in a nice and pretty way that isn't so obvious and look nice get rid of some of these puddles and stuff that are just kind of hanging out like these just hanging out they don't have a purpose we'll just go through level those out build some Build some range up in there. Um, so let's get at it. If you lose my audio here, it's because I've turned it off. Just because I'm most likely going to uh, speed up this entire process by doing that. So um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and throw down some measurements. Just where kind of the original fairway was kind of set up there. Um, that way we don't lose that as we add um, as we add some some splan points here. Because the idea is that we would add to the path. We want that to go this way. Then we're gonna edit. Add more to the path. Make that one go this way as well. And maybe one more I think adding to the path that's wonderful okay so now we can take these and kind of shift them around a little bit I think we need one more maybe to make it really make sense cool so what I'm gonna do is just gonna move this move this spine point out to about where I want that ridge to end I'm gonna move this one as well there somewhere. Get this one out here somewhere. Cool. Let's smooth these out and see what we're looking at. Okay, that's headed in the right direction. You can kind of get an idea for this ridge here. May end up having to add a few more just to round it out, but I think that's a good start. Let's go ahead and add a. Oop. Let's add more. Uh, not make it more complicated. Okay. Let's move this one a little bit closer down here toward our original. That way, whenever it combines down there, it will have. Um, yeah, it'll it'll be nice and whatever that is. We can obviously play with these a little bit. Mirror handle on this one. See if we can 
need to kind of smooth out a bit. There we go. That's a little better. Distance marker. Let's go ahead and clear all of those. I feel like we kept all the main shape there pretty pretty solid. Um, let's now go into some bland sculpting. We use our favorite brush for mountains here. Advanced edit. And let's just scale this guy up. And scale it up and then we can always adjust our adjust our fairway and such to match. We'll kind of cut into that. Ooh, I don't know how I feel about that. Let's undo that. A little too aggressive. Too aggressive. Let's reset, maybe flatten it out a bit here. We can kind of see through it, but it's still there. Still there. Okay. I don't know if that's what I had in mind, but I'm not hating the direction that's going. Just flatten that out there, shrink it down, cut away some more of it. Now we can go back through and use our softer brushes here to uh, round out this fairway a little bit more. Make it blend in here. I'm just going to take this off. Another thing we can do is move these spline points around that way. You know, that's not really even a factor. Not this one. We should be able to get something pretty interesting out of this. Narrows up the fairway quite a bit, and I think that's that's kind of what we were going for. That is what we were going for. Let's go ahead and add another point down here so we have a little bit more control. Just adding to this path over here. Nope, this one, this one, nope, 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 here, let's do this, edit, make sure it's closed, close the path, now we should be able to come in here, and add one right here, right on this side, then add it. Not the right one. Yeah, it's this one. I'm just not going to move on. Still not the right guy. Maybe this one. Eventually, eventually we'll find it. There it is. There it is. Let's bring that up around here. Maybe move it around a little bit more. Hey there. What's up? This rough is kind of falling apart here. It makes me wonder if that is in fact the right one. Oh, there's the right one. That's the right one that we want. I mean, we could do something like that as well, where the desert just kind of makes its way in there. Just kind of makes its way in there. Landing area is probably going to be about here if you're left, about here if you're right. So that really squeezes that in, um, which is kind of cool. Do, do, do. 
Let's close that path. That's not what I wanted. Not what I wanted at all. Okay. So something here is not right. Let's uh, smooth that out. There we go. Just need a little smoothing. Right, let's go ahead and fill that in now. Get an idea here of what we're looking at. All right. Move this point a little bit closer and it should get pretty darn close to connecting. So far, let's do. Um, I'm going to move this handle a little bit just to give us a little more room around this kind of canyon, canyon space here. Let's flatten this out just a smidge. Just going to have to reset that. Soften it out. It doesn't have to get rid of all the bumps, just smooth. Just smooth enough. And let's move this guy. Let's move those handles down. Something like that. That, see what that's what that's feeling. Get a little high. That is great. Just a little play test. All right, now if we go right at this, we got water left. Whoa! What just happened? I lost my swing meter. Difficulty. Whoa! Well, let's just go pro, see what happens. Let's bounce out of this and try it again. <laughs> that did not have all the things that we were looking for whenever it comes to a play test. I would like to have my swing meter. All right, let's play hole. Oh, I know what the problem is. I've started playing on PGA 2K23, and now I'm confused about where where all the power is. That was not a good swing. And we probably ought to do something about that. That's still pretty wavy. Got the wind right in our face. Oh yeah, peeled that one off. Mighty nice. Get a good kick into the bunker. So as far as fairway goes, it's not the end of the world. There's a better swing. Ooh, that's gonna be short. Short, short, short. There's the bogey. All right, I feel better about hole number one there. Let's try going the other way. See what happens. Same conditions, just going the shorter route. A little bit tighter. A little fast. Into the rocky cove, it looks like. Nope, we're going to sit down in the rough. So this is the shorter route between the two. Not a bad shot. 
still in the bunker. before I started jacking around with it. <laughs> okay, let's see what that looks like. Get back in here to the designer. Oh. I just got rid of like all of my assists here. I can't see the wind, can't do anything. Beginner mode. Wind is howling in from the left. I don't think I can. So now on 2K23, I would be um, putting this probably. Here, no fear. No fear here on 21. But I am playing pro level on 23, so that does also pay, play into it. I feel like I have all day to swing in the bunker. This has been a popular spot for me on these, this course uh, here on hole number three. I think we made it out of the bunker once, or made it into the bunker more, more often than I make it not in the bunker. not what we're looking for. So far the course playing pretty pretty stout. Look at about this wide fairway here. Super fast. On that I should probably touch up that bunker a little bit. Wind right in our face. playing. Seven. 
a little fast on that one, but not the end of the world. Still going to be in a good spot. Wind at our back a little bit here. Definitely gotta hold that. We need to find something soft. Just find the rough right off the back there. I'll let this one roll out. Yeah, it's still just a little bit short. Not the end of the world. Birdie. Number eight. Right toward the green. Hmm, does catch it a little, a little bit. I'll be right around the hole. Not in a bad spot at all. And to finish the front nine, get this guy. Using the wind faded in there. See if we can catch this hill here. If you do catch the hill, just it rolls all the way up, which is not not the recipe for success, I think. Just below the hole. I guess that's technically above the hole. Running it in there for the birdie. I guess that was par. Par there, man. All good. Okay. All right, let's go into plant mode and uh, let's see how much stuff we can plant.
All right, so there's some some stuff um, added there. Got some trees, some cactus, cacti, um, all sorts of all sorts of little bushes and whatnot available here. And uh, that's gonna round it out here for the front nine and planting here at Mammoth Pass. Um, looking forward to publishing this guy, and that may be the next time you see it. I may just go ahead and finish it out. Publish this guy onto PGA Tour 2K23. Um, that way everyone can play it on the new game. I'm excited to share this with everyone. So um, if you haven't already, be sure that you're following our channel. You hit that subscribe button and uh, drop us a like. That way uh, we know what's going on. I really appreciate you guys. And um, have a uh, have a great day.